intro to talk about the plight of the African American man, yes. male. And of course, George Floyd fits that uh, profile. And go out a little further in the book and talk about how you had some similar profile Correct. Uh, as you and your boys went through the neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, but it actually happened prior to that. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I grew up in, in another city, where I was born in another city and relocated here as a child. Mm -hmm. And prior to coming here, I had gone to a school where it was only us, there was no other race of people. And so when I got here, uh, I had to integrate. I had to ride a school bus uh, to school. Mm -hmm. And I had to be in the classroom where there was just one other African-American male in that classroom and that was very challenging. And so I didn't realize or understand because it's not, you know, how we're raised. People are people no matter the color of their skin as, as children are raised. But I experienced an encounter in the sixth grade to make you realize. This is your trophy moment? It's my trophy moment. Okay. You Talk got, about that. <clears throat> so you gotta understand. So I grew up in poverty, lived in the project, yep. you know, right? And we had um Whatever we had, we, we didn't know we were poor. It was just, you know, who we were. And so I had participated in a, a, a basketball skills competition. Yes, sir. And I won first place. That's a big to do. Right? I had never won a trophy before in my life. I didn't I hadn't even participated, but the first contest, I was in I won first place trophy. Now back then, we were show and tell at school. So I made myself a little bit, right? But we were show and tell at school, so I took control of the school to show, show and tell. To show and tell. And I had a classmate, you know, the envious or whatever it may have been, to knock it off the teacher's desk and be broken. He said, I'm not only you gonna show and tell, I'm gonna beat you to it. Right. In the sense of that irritation. Correct. So talk about it. So we you know, I, I just uh, you know, so you learn stuff over time, right? My first reaction was, I got to deal with you to check for breaking my trophy. You know, and I did that, but as time progressed through that particular school year, uh, I struggled with the educator, who just happened to be a white female. Mm -hmm. And uh, I would share that with my mother. And so eventually, the principal got involved. It's in the book, and uh, dealt with that, that, that educator, and I went on to have a, a, a productive, learning experience the violence of that school. You're listening to uh